everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Jedi Knight episode something. There's Quesh, the disgusting, filthy planet that it is. Last time, however long it was now, we needed to go save Sejar, who is Matatol Braga's Padawan, from Quesh, and the, the, the quest title is The Emperor's Wrath. So I imagine it's going to involve... But but not Kranatoko because that that just would no sadly not Kranatoko no I think I, I imagine the Emperor's wrath you know Kranatoko became the Emperor's wrath after this guy that's my guess um, because of course I sort of became the Emperor's wrath after Quesh happened so and we're assuming that all the sort of things on Quesh happened near enough around about the same time all the class stories. So I imagine, you know, because Kranatoka Kranato became the Emperor's Wrath after Quest. So, yes, this happens, then Kranatoko happens. So, yeah, there we go. To think, we're nearly on the back end part of Jedi Knight story. So, well, I'm, not, I'm not saying we're, we're, we're there. We've still got a little while to go. But, you know, we're getting close. We're getting close to the end. We've just got, like, I think a couple more planets in Chapter 2, and then we've got Chapter 3. Chapter 3 is, like, the shortest, remember? So, we're nearly there. And, of course, we have to go to this guy. Welcome to... <laughs> just need the inoction. No. I just want that. Yes. But you can go away. Not that I ever I'm going to abandon you because I don't ever want to do you. I just wanted the inoculation. That is all. Because that is the stupidest thing that you have ever got to do on Quest. I mean, I understand in terms of story, but any new players that come along and they're going to go down, they're going to go to the ship on the uh, space station and they're going to be like, well, where do I get the inoculation from? They're going to have no idea if they are just avoiding all of the uh, story arcs for the planets. So... I yeah, know it's it's kind of ridiculous. Where am I going? Um, can I just take a speeder there? I don't know. Um, Mechanized travel is for official business only. Is it worth it? Yeah. You why the hell not? Here. Let's see what happens. I'm very hungry. I want some food, but I can't be bothered to go get some food. I could die in the seat right now. It's like when people say that they're too tired to fall asleep. Like what? That makes absolutely no sense. So I'm too hungry to go get some food. Well, you know, if, if I was hungry, that hungry, I had to never want to move, I am just going to be stuck here for the rest of my starving, miserable, weak life. So yeah, I'm going to die in the seat now. But at least this episode will go up. What do I need to enter? I apparently need to enter some sort of cave or something. Uh, which is over there. Ah, that's where I need to enter, is it? Okay, then. Seija! Get around. Seija! Um... Down there. Who are you? Ah, some Republic sentries. Hi, how are you? What, what, are, you, what are you doing here? Um... Okay. Wait, where am I even going? Uh, all the way there. Okay, so... Why, why are there Republic sentries? You arrive at Crash, go to the Adrenal base to find out. Oh, okay, that's what. Yeah. I was wondering why are there Republic people here? I thought it was going to be like Empire people here, but no. Um, we're in a Republic base. Cool. Sejar, 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 Sejar. My master sent you, didn't he? You look a little pale. Of course. My shame is complete. Shame? War. I wasn't ready. I never should have left Tython. You left this base nearly defenseless. These people need a Jedi, not a coward. I'm not a coward. Not a Jedi, either. When the Empire first invaded, soldiers here captured some Imperial scouts. Brought them to me for interrogation. The prisoners angered me. I killed them. Lied about what happened. When Imperial forces arrived outside, I hurled the corpses at them. Revealed my true face. Master Braga told me about your past. He said you embraced the light side. I thought I'd changed. I want to. But this war... The only reason I stayed is because an Imperial officer recognized me. Called me by my old name. Said the Emperor's wrath is coming. Dun, dun, dun. He's sending his personal executioner for me. His wrath incarnate. 
I will be punished for my crimes. But you're condemning the brave Republic men and women here, too. I can't save them, and they won't retreat. What can I do? Fighting would accelerate my return to the dark side. I'd rather die with Jedi teachings in my heart. Right. I'm no counselor, but this guy's a few banthas short of a herd. He's not gonna be much help. I guess I've gotta deal with it, haven't I? Lieutenant Gundo, 86th Infantry. You're here just in time. We got Imperial forces massing outside. My engineers jury rigged some ray shields, but it'll take time to seal the base. Unless you people hold the main entrance, we're dead. Please. You don't know what you're asking me to do. I can't fight them. You can. And you will. You made this mess. You'll help clean it up. Arm yourself. Move. Falling in defense of others would be a good death. We're out of time. Imperials are coming through. Defend the main entrance. Okay, well, Sejar, sadly... Oh! So they've always had this feature in then, have they? Where somebody can follow you. Okay, I thought it was like only a coffee thing, but... I've always had it. Alright. Um, I'm going completely the wrong way. I need to go this way. And protect the base! Because it's all about that base, remember? No trouble. Hi, imps! How are you? Oh, a Sith Marauder. Kralatoka is a Sith Marauder as well. But you're not Kralatoka. Alright, so I've got to clear the entire base of the Imperials. I've got to kill everyone. Everyone. R really? <sighs> Great. Wait, hold on. Why would you be attacking a base and then just start patrolling? Why would you even do that? I mean, you've not exactly got the base. You're still attacking it. I don't know. But I'm going to blow this up so that you all get choked to death. Done yet? Nope. Still more need to kill. Great. Oh, hello. What are you doing? You're running at me. Why? Why are you running at me? Okay, then. You the last one? Still no. Oh, there's another one. Oh, hello. Didn't see you there. I thought it was just this guy. Okay. No. Don't do that. There we go. And now I've got to go back. Um, speak to Lieutenant Gundo. Oh, he's over here, is he? Oh, okay. Why is he over here? Okay. Could have had, could have done with some help, but thanks. Embrace the dark side. That's it! We did it! With the ray shields up, we can hold out until reinforcements get here. Then we kill our enemies. Yes. Destroy them to the last man. No. No. That's not... I told you. I shouldn't have done this. Hang on. We've got movement outside the ray shield. Who is that? The Emperor's Wrath. What a mystery the Force can be. I came seeking a traitor, but found you instead. The time draws near. If you mean the time of your death, I'll have the Lieutenant open the Ray Shield now. Reckonings arrive at their own pace. No need to rush them. You're strong and touched by darkness. That is unexpected. An advantage? Possibly. You may keep the Dark Council traitor. I smell his weakness. He'll die by his own hand, given the chance. Admit it. You don't want to face me. Arrogant and prideful. Surprising in so many ways. The Emperor must hear of our meeting. I won't disappoint him with delays. Farewell for now. Is it freezing in here, or is that just my blood crystallizing? It's a little nippy. That other Jedi seemed pretty upset. Maybe you ought to talk to him while we secure things here. I have to. Uh... Fine, Seja, hi. The Emperor's wrath is gone. He isn't coming back for you. I had no doubts about myself during that battle. I felt good. Clean. Free. Nothing makes sense anymore. I don't know what to do. Kill yourself. No. 
Uh, keep on destroying the enemy, basically. Yeah, yeah, that's what you've got to do. I've killed dozens, maybe hundreds of Imperials. Am I evil? Yes. No. Yes. To win, we must kill the enemy before they kill us. Master Braga doesn't understand that, but I do. If you can be what's necessary, a weapon to destroy all who threaten the Republic, then you'll be a hero. Funny. I always thought being a hero would sound... heroic. You're asking me to do exactly what the Empire commanded. Defend its civilization at all costs. The people you came from are a plague that needs eradicating. You can't save them. My master said I could be saved. Am I the only one? Master Braga says one thing and you say the opposite. But I feel the truth of your words. That's because we're both dark side. I'll meditate on your guidance. Please tell my master I'm alright. May the Force be with you. I'm so evil. I'm so evil. Wait, where's the ratio gone? Ratio should be here. I shouldn't be able to get out at all. You know? Unless this is technically a ray shield. Technically, and as soon as I go through. Ray shields up! Hooray! Yeah! Hooray! I know it's not a ray shield, it's just a phase thing. Uh, back to my ship. I go. Well, that's done. Master Braga, your Padawan and the Republic base are safe. The Imperials attacked, but I drove them off. Drove them Sejar off. had a crisis of confidence, but I set him on the right path. He isn't afraid to fight anymore. That may be so, but Quest is no place for a Padawan. I'll have him transported somewhere safe. Thank you for confirming Sejar as well. Do you have anything else to report? Mm, nope. My mission here is complete. I'm preparing to leave Quesh. Our strike team is pursuing a new goal on the ice planet Hoth. We're up against pirates and Imperials there. We need your help. Travel to Hoth and contact Jedi Knight Leha Norez. She'll explain more. May the Force be with you. Master Braga, out. What consequences would that have that I didn't reveal that I met the Emperor's Wrath? Would that have any consequences whatsoever? I Somehow I doubt it. Oh, speed of pilot team rank 3. Fair enough. Oh, I didn't have my buffs up. I never do, do I? Where are they? Um, I've lost them again. Why have I lost them? Where the hell are they? Um, no. There they are. I keep losing my buffs. Seriously. Right, let's travel to Hoth. <laughs> Suicide Squads. <laughs> uh, it wasn't a bad film. Suicide Squad wasn't terrible. Uh, people will hate it for some reason. I, it was better than Batman vs Superman for sure. But that's just my opinion. This is Jedi Knight Leha Nerez. Please identify. Master Tall Braga sent me to help you. I already received word of your success on Balmora. Glad you're here. As if Hoth wasn't hostile enough. I'm contending with the Empire and White Maw pirates of all things. I'm getting a lot of interference on this end. What's the problem? The planet's atmosphere plays havoc with calm frequencies. We're lucky to have any signal at all. Hoth's one of the largest starship graveyards in the galaxy. During the war, there was a massive battle in orbit. Dozens of vessels crashed to the surface. Because of the freezing cold, they remained well preserved. Some are almost intact. Were there valuables aboard when they went down? That's putting it mildly. One of the crash vessels contained a full technical readout of the Emperor's fortress. A map of the bad guy's house. Nice. One of the Empire's top scientists during the war upgraded the fortress's defenses. He was the only non-Sith to ever see the inside. The technical readouts were lost when the scientists crashed here. His shipwreck has never been found. I doubt those technical readouts survived. This is a waste of time. You'd be amazed what's still intact. There's a good reason everyone's coming to Hoth. Those technical readouts are critical to infiltrating the Emperor's fortress. We will not fail. <laughs> T7 polished, charged, and ready. Who I've said you come with the me? Main Republic base. Take a shuttle to the surface and meet me there. Leha Nerez out. Okay, let's go meet with Leha on Hoth. That sounds like a weird name. Leha! Leha! Yes, very weird. Still so very hungry. Still can't be bothered to go get food. So do I need an inoculation as well due to how cold it is? No, no, no one's gonna give me an inoculation for that. 
Cool. Well, thank goodness. <laughs> I just realised what I said there. Cool. Thank goodness. Cool. Get it? Get it? Because it's a cold planet. It's it's cool, cool. Shut up. Sorry I couldn't meet you. We've got a full-scale Imperial invasion on our hands. They caught us by surprise. We knew the Empire was here. How could they possibly surprise us? Until now, the Empire has been more interested in the White Maw Pirates than us. I'm defending a forward outpost, but our support team is pinned down closer to you. I'm sending the coordinates now. So I've got to say, if you're looking day. for a detachment from the 301st Infantry led by Sergeant Rusk, his squad is being overrun by Imperial probe droids. Master Braga said no one knows about our strike team. How did Republic soldiers get involved? They don't know the details of our mission. Only that we're trying to save the galaxy. Those soldiers are in terrible danger. The probe droids are making suicide runs, exploding when they get close. Saw things like that on Belmora. They can make a real mess. Sergeant Rusk has vital information we need. I'm counting on you to keep him and his men alive. May the Force be with you. Well, may the Force be with you as well. Okay, well, let's go save our companion. I mean, not, not our companion. No, no, Rusk isn't our companion at all. No, 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 no. Spoilers. I mean, I say spoilers, but come on. This game has been out for nearly five years now. If you didn't know this, <sighs> then... Cold. You've been here for about two freaking minutes! I left Balmora for this frozen wasteland? What was I thinking? You're thinking, hey, I'm a hot chick on a cold planet. Mwah, mwah. I will say, Hoth does still look pretty though. Looks very, very pretty. Can I just can't, I can't ever fault it. Nope, can't ever fault how pretty it looks. I mean, if they, if they, maybe if they dimmed down the glow a little bit, I could probably say it would look even prettier. But you know, that's the whole point of Hoth. Uh oh, no, 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 no! Damn it! Well, I'm just gonna run. You enjoy death, Doc. I won't miss you. Well, I will, because I plan to romance you on this character. But bye, Doc. Mm -hmm. You're alive! Yay! You're alive! Okay, now I've got to fall to my death. Well, I didn't mean it literally. Oh, and I gotta go. No, I'm quick traveling. I'm not gonna travel that far on a mount. No. Why does this game do this to me sometimes? Here you go. Going the safer way around now. Since you want to bloody kill me from that small drop. Oh, this is nice and tucked away, isn't it? Ah, very snazzy and cozy. Um, hi, Imperials. I would like to stealth by you, but I can't. Ooh, achievements. I'm trying to explode this. Thank you. Jeez, uh, how much more have I got to do? Okay, so I've got the last achievement for the droids on Hoth. Yay! There's still quite a few achievements I need to try and get, though, on planet, so. I think I'm 100% of Korriban and Droman Cass. Um, am I 100% of any other planets? I think that's really it. Uh, Korriban. Um, oh, I haven't 100% of German cast. Oh, I've still got droids. Oh, I've really not got many droids to kill then. Um, and i got some law objects and things I need to kill as well. Um, so yeah, I've actually got a lot more than I thought. Okay. But definitely on the bright side, I've only 100 percent to Korriban, so know that. Do I do the bonus mission? Well, I might as well. It's only 15. And I'm probably going to kill them on my way there anyway. So, yeah. Oh, you're frozen in time. Okay. Enjoy being frozen in time. No, you're not going to blow up in front of me. Take your medicine. What medicine? I didn't know I was prescribed anything. And one more droid. Need to kill the suicide droid. And then we're done. Thank you for the experience. For the experience and the experience, I should say. <laughs> it works both ways. Rusk, I'm here to save you because you can't do your jobs properly. Leon Nerez sent me. Looks like I got here just in time. No worries, Master Jedi. I was prepared to hold this position indefinitely. Hakuna Matata. Sergeant Fiddleton Rusk, 301st Infantry. My squad's at your service. 
There's no more squad. We're all that's left. We're a squad until I say otherwise, Private. Now on your feet. Sound like my kind of, kind of sergeant. No time for R&R. &R. Imperial forces are everywhere. Take it easy. That soldier needs medical attention. Oh, go medical! Reload your weapons, Private. The mission isn't complete. Our objective was to secure Imperial survey maps of the Starship Graveyard. Target achieved. Imperial counterattackers pursued us here. Squad fatalities, 66.4%. Enemy fatalities, 100%. Hang on. I'm picking up a fresh wave of probe droids outside. They're headed this way. Make those droids sorry they ever came here. You heard her. Secure that door. Here they come! Cool. <laughs> it's fun. <laughs> He's probably gonna die, isn't he? I can see it happening. He's gonna be like, Oh, the droid shot me! I'm dying! Oh no, I'm di Oh, only three? Oh, okay. Thought it was gonna be more than that. Got all of them? Private? Yes, sir. Did they cut the lights, or...? Uh-oh! Squad fatalities. 83.3%. <laughs> so, what? I'm not that much of an ass! We better move out, before more reinforcements arrive. I'll take the private's identichip. Don't want him reported MIA. These are the Imperial survey maps of the Starship Graveyard. Leha Nerez wants to see them. I'll return to base and reconstitute my squad. We'll meet you at our coordinates ASAP. Stay sharp out there. This is where we find out later on down the line he's actually still alive. But, oh well. This is General Callan Green, Republic High Command. I just arrived in orbit above Hoth. Quite a mess down there. I'm told you commandeered some men from the 301st Infantry for your classified operation. The Imperial Offensive left us in bad shape. We've been scratching your back. Now we need a favor. I have no obligation to repay you anything. What about defending the Republic? You still do that, right? Scout teams detected several Imperial weapon platforms under construction in the ice fields near our base. If the enemy sets artillery that close, they can shoot down our shuttles. I need you to destroy those weapon platforms. Now. Don't you have any troops to spare for this assault? You've seen what it's like down there. We're barely holding on. General Varsuthra tells me you can work miracles on a battlefield. I'm counting on it. You're receiving coordinates to the Imperial weapon platforms now. Good luck. General Green out. Yes, I am the Jesus of the Jedi. I can perform miracles. I can turn snow into water. I know why. That's amazing. Oh, uh, so I got what? I got three arrows needs. Oh, great. So I need to go back up there. Um, hopefully you don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. When I say don't see me, I actually mean don't see me. Don't you know what that means? Well, I just told you, so you should know. I'm gonna blow you up. Say goodbye to your life. Okay, well, you haven't said goodbye to your life just yet. But you will do in about ten seconds. There you go. Enjoy the cold darkness. And don't forget to say hello darkness, my old friend. Thinking about it, is that where the song came from? Hello darkness, my old friend. So, because of course we were born out of the dark. When you think about it, because you know, what, what do you remember before you were born? Absolutely nothing. So, hello darkness, my old friend. Is that referring to death? You know, because when you die, it is just darkness. Well, supposedly anyway. So, is that is that what he's referencing in the song? That's that's my theory. I I don't know. Eh. Alright, that's that all done. I thought it was gonna be Alpha. Okay, that's Delta done. Need Beta and oh god, I've got so far to go. I say we, me. You guys can just skip it because I'm gonna skip it for you. Hi. Hello. You all right? Yeah. I tell you what I'll do. I will actually. Activate this, and then I'm gonna run away because I just cut. Nah, I better not run away because then I have a bunch of enemies attacking me at once, and we don't want that. Why, blimey, there's so many things being dropped on the floor. Wish they would stop. Haha, -ha. enjoy being in flames. Doc, I need you to heal me. Doc, I need you. Doc. Not feeling so good. Well, I healed myself up anyway. Blimey, how many are there? I think there's like eight I'm attacking right now. Blimey. Well, we're nearly there, Doc. How about if you got out the fire first? Maybe? Maybe? Yeah? Get out the fire? Perhaps? No? Alright, you stay in the fire. That's fine. I think I lost count on how many I actually attacked there. 
There must have been at least eight or nine. That was unbelievable. But we survived. In any case, I've got to keep running because there's still a bunch of enemies attacking me. Run, Kashilla! Run! Oh no! What are we gonna do? Well, they're evading anyway. Oh, cool. That's that's fine. But now I need to jump back up. Can I can I get back up? Because I need I need to get I need to get. <sighs> Damn it! There we go. Oh god, I'm here there now. Oh, just four this time. Whew. Need a medic? What? We just started fighting. Okay, I'll let you kill that guy while I get the last one. There we go. Scouts report the Imperial artillery teams are retreating. Nice work. Thank you. I have a feeling I'll need you again before this is over. Hope you're planning to stick around. I've done you enough favors. Don't push it. Understood. General Grain out. <laughs> Doc really didn't like that. Tough, Doc. Tough. Where am I going now? Uh, in that outpost, apparently. Can I quick travel there? Uh, yeah, sort of. Oh, is this a Jedi Knight? Oh, this whole area is a Jedi Knight phase. Okay. I have the Imperial survey maps of the Starship Graveyard. I understand Sergeant Rusk's squad paid dearly for these. Meaty One, please analyze the maps. Find any profile that matches a Pythar class Imperial shuttlecraft. The little droid beeps excitedly whilst invisible. You. They're great fans of yours. I didn't realize I'd become a droid celebrity. Maybe that's why those probe droids kept rushing at you. Why are you invisible Ever as well? Since I built the Medes, I've been teaching them Jedi history, philosophy, everything. Someday, the Medes will prove that even droids can use the Force. If a droid became Force sensitive, that would be extraordinary. The Council doesn't believe me, but I think it's already happened more than once. Throughout history, certain droids have achieved well beyond their design limitations. I believe the Force is the answer. Droids who go long enough without memory wipes develop personalities. Couldn't they develop more than that? I think you're onto something, Leah. You're the first member of our order to admit the potential. Even Master Braga is skeptical. MED1 beats you found whistles. Something? Let me see. Hmm. The Empire recently discovered a crash site matching the scientist vessel. Imperial forces are excavating the wreck at an ice cavern nearby. We need to move fast, and we'll need reinforcements. Tell our backup he needs to pull that new squad together yesterday. I'll contact Sergeant Rusk and inform him of the situation. You and I will hit the enemy from two directions. I'll enter the cavern at these coordinates. You go in at this entrance. We'll meet in the middle. MED-1 whistles worriedly. Don't worry, MED. The Force is with us. I'll see you at the cavern. Has there ever been, like, proper Force-sensitive droids mentioned in previous Star Wars lore? If anybody could point that out to me, I'd like to actually read up on that. You know, Force-sensitive droids. That sounds like a very cool thing. But anyway, we're going to leave it there for now. We've got a little bit more to do on uh, Hoth. I'd say a little bit more. We've got, like, another episode's worth, I should say. But next time, we'll be heading over there. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. And I shall see you next time. And a farewell to you.